<laughs> um, <laughs> I don't know what I want to talk about in this video. Um, I was gonna say something and I forgot. Fuck if I know. Fuck me. It's six o'clock. <laughs> Today is um Thursday, April the fifth, I think. Is it the fifth? Yeah, I think so. Um Hold on, I, I gotta, I, this music's too loud, stand by. Have I mentioned yet that my steps are falling apart? Not my steps, my whole porch. Steps are fixed, steps are fine. The whole porch as a whole is just a death trap, basically. Man, I fucking left my tree out in the sun too long today and I fucking just got too much sun, man. I wish I had a spot in my front yard that would provide some shade. I'd like to be able to keep it outside, but keep it in the shade. Cause man, when I keep it inside, it just slowly starts to die, and it's fucking aggravating. Um. Okay, so my um my 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 daily super mega climb and subscribers seems to have leveled off today. Um. I've only gotten 15 new subs, and I've been averaging like 80 a day over the past week. Um, so for whatever reason, it um, seems to be slowing down back to normal. Whatever. Like I've already said before, if I got one subscriber or one million, nothing is going to change about me or my video content or my delivery or my amount of profanity or whatever um so man I was gonna talk about like what I did in the Marines I had a really really fucking cool job um y'all remember the movie Top Gun the dudes on the aircraft carriers giving all the hand signals and fucking shit remember that all those dudes with the yellow and green and red vest on. I was one of the dudes with the yellow vest. I was a point man. Which meant I stood at about the between 600 and 700 foot mark of the runway when a fucking plane would come in and drop its tail hook and it had to fucking land like that. I was the dude at the very front as it was coming and I would run out and give brakes off and then I'd have to fucking give the rewind signal so my guys running the um, cable engines could rewind it a little bit and then I would stop it and then it would stop and then the plane would fucking eek backwards just a little bit and when the tail hook was clear of the cable then I'd fucking drop it down to one knee and give the tail hook up and then I would tell them go oh man that was a good fucking job it was so exciting dream when you are staring down at a 40,000 pound 40 million dollar fighter jet going 180 miles an hour and you're really hoping that when that tail hook hits the deck it grabs the cable and stops before it runs you over whoo man that is that is some adrenaline junkie juice right there man that was a cool fucking job I so so wish I had some video footage of it I got a lot of still pictures which are cool, but they don't accurately, uh, <laughs> they, don't, they don't do it any justice. They just don't. God damn. And it's hard to find footage. I can find some footage from, uh, from uh, aircraft carriers. I didn't work on an aircraft carrier. I was on a land base, but it was the same exact deal. It was, it was fucking intense, man. I love that job. Um, there was no relatable employment in the uh, civilian world 
that I could go into. There's no outside of the military. You don't have fighter jets landing like that. So I wouldn't change it though. Fuck that. I loved it. I wish I'd have stayed in longer. I wish I would have gone to Iwakuni, Japan, like I was scheduled to. I regret um, not fighting harder to finish out my term, but I broke my back and I couldn't run anymore. Um, I probably could have got some medical releases or something, but I was working like 20 hours a day. I just wanted to get out. So I got out after a few years, but I wish I would have stayed in longer. Actually, the path I wish I would have taken was do that for about three or four years and then go to drill instructor school, be a drill instructor for a couple of years, and then just finish up back at my job. That's the route I wish I would have taken, but I didn't. So here we are, me wearing a fucking hat, not that far off from a drill instructor's hat. Um, I just, uh... I have some friends in my world that need some positive energy at the moment, so I'm sending it your way. Inhale it. Hold on to it. Exhale through your nose slowly. Inhale my good. Exhale the fucking negativity and bad. Um, I moved my handcuffs from way over here on that outside screw to the inside in between Sammy and my Mardi Gras no parking parade route sign. I, I like it there because it um, shows up in the frame a little better. These fucking birds. I need y'all to shut up. Zip, zip it. I'm trying to film a fucking video here. I need y'all to zip it for five minutes, please. I do hear some frogs chirping, but not many. I thought there'd be more. It rained last night. I had no idea it was supposed to rain. It fucking rained all night. Yard's kind of filled up, which is good because when there's a fresh water source, what does that mean, people? You've watched enough of my videos. What does it mean when there's a fresh water source? Not mosquitoes. We already know mosquitoes dominate fucking Louisiana. Dragonflies are in abundance when there is some sitting fresh water. And why do we love dragonflies? Because they attack and eat wasps. I need to have another conversation with the the community as a whole explain to them what the plan is here do frogs eat wasps i don't think so maybe they do i saw bar clavius today he was extremely green normally he's brown he blends in with my porch but um very green he must be on the hunt he must be in the grass a lot he was running up the fucking um little banister there on my porch <laughs> he looked good he looked healthy strong nice solid green he was prob probably just coming back for a nice little hunt for his family Barclavius is my pet lizard by the way he's been with me for a couple of years now I have him on camera on a couple of videos I have his little head he likes to run up this broom handle and turn and look at me oh man this video is really 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 not about much um it's just Thursday. I feel pretty good. Um, I got a couple of VA doctor's appointments coming up in uh, No, I have a dentist appointment this month to get some crowns on my bottom teeth. And then I have VA, yeah, VA May 14th, I think, with my regular doc. I don't know, something like that. Whatever, this is interesting to about fucking four people. Um, but I just want to say thanks to everybody who watches, hits the like button, takes the time to leave a comment, fucking love you. You know that I do. Um, oh, I bought a new microphone for my live streams, because the mic that is attached to my webcam is straight ass. So I got a little condenser mic, it's called, um, fuck me, I don't remember what it's called, I don't remember the brand. I don't know. It wasn't very expensive, but it's got to be better than what I'm getting. When I rewatch or try to rewatch and edit my live streams, ugh, the audio just fucking makes my ears bleed. Um, so, 
yeah, there's that. Um, I really don't have anything else, man. I just wanted to uh, check in, say hey, um, send out some good energy to whoever needs it. I mean, I know in my head and heart specifically who I'm speaking to, but I don't want to get on here and start rattling off names. That's not very professional. I like, to, I like to protect people's privacy, even though I have no respect for my own privacy. Not at all out there. Um, I don't need to be specifically talking about my friends and loved ones. Now, do I? No. Anyhow, um... Everybody have a good Thursday, whatever's left of it. I hope it's good and fun and eventful or chill, relax, and fucking get some sleep. Speaking of getting some sleep, I had a gigantic lunch, so I'm going to take my medicine early tonight. Last night I took it a little bit later than I normally did, thinking it was going to hit me faster, and it didn't. I didn't go to bed as early as I wanted to, so I'm going to take it much, much earlier tonight. Because I have a stomach full of... Sushi. Not really sushi. I got spicy tuna salad, which is just raw tuna mixed in with spicy mayo and some hibachi fried rice. Alright, so everybody have a good Thursday. Until my next video. Everybody stay fucking cool with yo. She said I don't know if I've ever been good enough. I'm a little bit rusty and I think my head is caving in. And I don't know if I've ever been really loved By a hand that's touched me And I feel like something's gonna give And I'm a little